Some of you missed us, and we missed you too. We dropped a few beats and time to share what is going on. We had to make some life-changing decisions in less than 24 hours, and it all led to us leaving our home quite abruptly and not producing weekly vlogs anymore. You could say our lives got turned upside down. What are you doing? They're cleaning a boat. What are you cleaning? They're cleaning a boat. Show me. What's that? That's a big machine, Ben. Uh, I did find ones. Yes? Well, do you know how to operate it? I think I don't think you know how to operate it. Um, <laughs> Whoa, what's that? Jai. Yeah. Yeah, do my day. Harder? Yeah.
So, no Montenegro. We had to fly home to the Netherlands, back to the place where I uh, grew up and where I was born. We were driving in Montenegro and we received a call from my dad that he was driving behind an ambulance telling us that he was, uh, my mother was in the ambulance and it was not good. The first thought I had was um, she had a heart attack because my, grand, uh, my grandparent, he died uh, at a bus stop just with a heart attack. But um, it turned out that it's not a heart attack and it's not a heart failure, but something completely else. We just uh, took a decision. Yeah, we didn't know what to do exactly. We had like one week left that I was able to fly because after 36 weeks of pregnancy, you're not allowed to fly anymore. So we had to decide what to do. And we still didn't know what was going on with your mom precisely, only that she had a tumor. Yeah. Um, so we decided to not risk it that we could not travel back to uh, the Netherlands to be there for the family. So we decided after we just figured everything yeah. out. Just one day, one day before. <laughs> so we found a hospital, we found a place where, yeah, where you could give birth. Yeah, and where we would stay after the birth, just cocooning and, and being a family again. Uh, but yeah. Family of four. Yeah, but uh, yeah, it turned out a little bit different. Yeah. And so we're, uh, we decided to just pack up our things, take one of the last flights I was able to, uh, to join and uh, go back here to support your, uh, support your family. Yeah. Your mom and your dad. Yeah, because um, yeah, my mom is 75, my father is 76 and yeah, we are there and um, I think to reunite with the family and with Benjamin around, I think that's very helpful and give a lot of positive energy. Positive and energy. Love and yeah, so this is completely different. So we decided to just stop everything, also to stop making YouTube videos, not for forever, no. but just for the time being. Maybe we would say we record one or two here. Uh, but we pick it up again when we're back on the perfect sense and we're sailing again. Yeah. So um, if you would like to keep being updated, follow us on Instagram that we still post daily or weekly uh, stories, what we're doing. And the plan is to give birth here, which is also something positive because in Montenegro I could only do the C-section. Yeah. And here actually a natural birth is a possibility. So um, we're really excited about that. So yeah, we will see, just see what kind of treatment your mom needs, what the life expectancy is, and then we decide when we go back to Montenegro and when we start sailing again. Yeah, so we keep you updated. And we always say, you can have a plan in life, but life has a plan with you too. And uh, yeah, that's the case for now. Yeah, and it is on us to find the meaning and to stay positive and to make something great about it again, which we're actually doing. We're having a good time here. Yeah, we're having a good time. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's so good to, to be back and to see my father and mother playing around with Benjamin. And yeah, he just makes the best out of it. Yeah. That's it, sorry That's guys. It. No sailing for a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> but we will back But soon. we will get back <laughs> to share and feel the breeze again. Mm -hmm.